it because in non inertial framework, a force named the pseudo force comes up. That means that the whole physics should uh, be divided into two parts. So, is it true? Frame is like a, a perspective. Right, And so the thing is, when somebody is accelerating, that means they will have a totally different perspective than someone at rest. So if you were watching somebody accelerate in a car, and then that person is watching you, the person in the car is watching you, they won't see themselves accelerating, they will see you accelerating in the opposite direction as they drive away from you. So that doesn't make sense. Because we know from Newton's second law, any acceleration has to be caught by force. So to make up for it, we say that in some reference frames, in a reference frame where somebody is accelerating, we have to make up what we call a pseudo force, as you said, that explains why the, somebody is accelerating when there shouldn't be any force it's working on. So it's not really splitting into two parts, but it's a side effect of looking from another person's perspective. And you'll see this a little bit more if you study rotation of this shit. He is a role model for all of you sitting here today. Um, you know, he is actually asking questions about what he has learned to try and understand more about physics instead of say, staying silent and memorizing it. And I think that's a role model that a lot of people need to follow. Asking questions is a very important task. So thank you so much for asking questions.